Hi, uh, I wanted to make a video because it's been a long time, uh, several weeks since my last video, and I just wanted to update people. First of all, thank you so much to the people that have reached out and asked me how I'm doing and words of encouragement and support. I couldn't do this, you know, I don't think emotionally, I couldn't get through this without, uh, you know, some of that cheerleading that people offer me. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. Um, that's very meaningful. Uh, if you've been keeping up with this channel, uh, you know that my mom died in February and um, my scan results since then weren't, maybe were a little worse than expected. And so I have to start all over now. Next week I'll start. Um, a whole new uh, cancer treatment and I'll know more next week so I can get into talking about what this will all entail but I'm going to include a list of the medications in the description of this video below. Uh, meanwhile my my hands are still a little sore we're gonna get another test an EMG next week to see what might be causing that so in the meantime I've been getting my nails done Let's see if it'll focus here by the window. I've been getting my nails done at a professional salon called the Natural Nails Bar here in town. And I'll leave a link below. I can't get it. Okay. I'll, uh, well, anyway, it's hollow sparkles. I brought my own nail polish because, you know, you buy your own nail polish and you're like, I want to use it. <laughs> so... They've been very kind. It's nice because they're a little faster too. So I'll be starting a new kind of targeted therapy. That's another oral drug. I'm told that I may need to wear gloves to handle it. Um, I have infusions for bone density thing. Um, again, I'll leave all these medication links below so that if you're curious to know what they are, what, the, what they're like, um, uh, if you know anybody that's been on those medications or if you yourself might be going on those medications, I have links to uh, what those medications are and what to expect from them below. Uh, also, again, the bone density thing because they're worried about fractures or I don't know if it's like for osteoporosis um, exactly, but they did say that with the two new lesions in my spine, now they're worried a little bit about spinal fracture or stuff like that. So we're just going to keep plugging along. I just needed some time to kind of catch my breath again. Uh, I've been in therapy a couple of times uh, to talk, you know, just some general talk therapy. I've been looking into some of the differences between going through grief and depression because sometimes grief can trigger um, an episode of depression. And what I have to say about that is there are some things that are um, what they call situational depression, which is healthy and normal, like going through grief, for example. But, you know, I'm still eating. I'm taking care of myself. I'm not currently on any cancer treatment at all. Uh, so I feel pretty good for the most part, but I'm still... Um, you know, I, I don't know really exactly what to expect from everything. Uh, I'm kind of going into this because I didn't want to read all of the side effect list because I don't want to give myself too many, uh, you know, I don't, I don't want to put anything in my head. Um, I'd rather just report my symptoms and see what they think. Uh, let's see, anything else? Uh, I don't know. I'm just very grateful for people, for um, just the support and love and kindness. And uh, I will know more probably next week. Uh, as I know more, I'll keep you informed and then you'll know more. So, <laughs> all right. Well, um, that's about as good as I can do right now. I don't really know much more. But um, again, thank you so much for watching my videos, for listening to me just for your kindness. And also, please be kind to yourself and others and um, have a great day. Take care. Bye.